Troublemaker always will be a troublemaker till the day I die. I like standing up for the underdog. I wouldn't have any other life. I've loved it. It always amazes me when I post a video about a certain topic, like the shooting in Colorado. And usually the first people to come running to open up their mouth are these born-again Christians. If I had a gun, that fucker would have come down. I would have been like SEAL Team 6. I've been crawling around in the dark, picked up to find the right spot. The right spot to just get that son of a bitch so he wouldn't kill another person. That's right. If only I had been given the chance in my bloodthirsty heart to be able to be a killer on the same level as that madman. You think Jesus would have had a gun? What would Jesus do? When people came to kill Jesus, did you see him go get weapons? That, I'm sorry, I missed that part in the Bible where Jesus says, ye, my disciples, grab up your weapons. The Romans are coming to kill me. They're coming to ex me on the cross -aid. Yeah, the Romans, I saw it in a vision. God's gonna kill me. I know he's my dad, but he's still gonna kill me. Why should you help me out with this? Well, let's see a couple of reasons why. Um, first of all, I took you out of that crappy job of fishing. Look at you now. You're hanging out with me, and let me tell you, there are some chicks following us. Have you seen Mary Magdalene? You want another reason why you should be protecting me right now from dying? I can turn water into wine. That's right. Have you noticed what I can do? You could just pump water in my ass and I would just sweat out my pores. Wine. I'm a walking wine machine. Who wouldn't want to have a machine walking around that every time they wanted wine, poof, bam, it's right there. You'll be drunk every night. It's a party when you're hanging out with JC. Who wouldn't kill for somebody that would make sure that they never starve ever in their whole life? Yo, oh, you want more? I don't know if you've noticed this little thing that I can do, but you got a bad eye? It's better. You don't even have a leg. A new one will grow in its place. I have that power, and guess what? Don't tell everyone this, but I can even make you come back from the dead. Yes, I can do that. We haven't gotten to that chapter yet, but wait till you see what I do with Lazarus. So get with it, you're fishermen. What do you mean, what are you gonna do to protect me? I don't go get fishermen stuff to make sure I'm not nailed to a cross. I'm thinking maybe hooks, fish hooks, big ones, I want the big ones. Get the big fish hooks and put them on the poles and tie them down really good so when the Romans come, you jab your eyes out. I, I, I don't think I read that anywhere where Jesus said that at any time. Well, didn't you read his words? I think he said, For if you forgive men when they sin against you, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive men their sins, your Father will not forgive your sins. So listen up, you born again fanatics. I don't think anywhere in that book of yours did Jesus ever say, kill them all and let God sort them out. In fact, he had an entirely different message, and that's the truth. Let me tell you the truth. The truth is what is. And what should be is a fantasy, a terrible, terrible lie that someone gave the people long ago. 